Hello, my name is Thomas Proft. I'm a master goldsmith. This is my profession. And here I have quick tip number one. It's about a setting for a stone, for a precious stone goes onto a ring. How you solder that onto the ring. Here you still have the setting loose. Then you have the ring on the other side. And here you have blocks, solder blocks. You also can take a charcoal block, also works. Here you have a solder cross locking tweezer. And it's very important that the handle of the tweezer is on the edge of the block. Now you put the ring into the tweezer and you put it on the block that the handle of the tweezer is on the edge of the block. That's very important. So it's very stable that it can't move around. Now exactly on this position, you put the setting underneath the ring, exactly in this position. Okay. It has to be very stable that it doesn't move around when you solder it. Now I uh, have a uh, a little steel block for security. You also can take a glass of water, it doesn't matter, works also. Here I have a little stone and with this stone I put underneath the handle of the tweezer so I can get exactly the right line in the middle of the connection point. Now I take flux, put it on the uh, solder joint now I take little solder pieces, about three pieces on each side. This should be sufficient. Now I take the torch and I solder it together. You start slowly and then you go uh, closer. Now here you have the finish goes into the acid and then you do the polishing work, put the stoning and you set it. Now if you are interested how this setting is being made. There's a very nice tutorial I have on my tutorial sites www.tp-gold-tutorials.com Here you see it again www.tp-gold-tutorials.com This is the tutorial number six. Very nice for beginners. We do that in one day. People who never did goldsmithing before learn to do this setting just on one day. And you can do the setting yourself, which is very nice.